Hi, my name is Anton van der Waal. I'm a leadership expert, author, mentor and speaker. With some 20 years experience uh, across the globe in countries such as China, Thailand, South Africa, Dubai, I'm passionate about creating global multinational CEOs, HR directors and teams. I published a book last year called Leadership Through My Lens and it uses photography to convey a leadership message. I'm very excited to be here today at the Robotic Process Automation Conference here in Dubai. And for the leaders of the company, it's about the responsibility and accountability of leadership and how they're going to use technology going forward. I love taking photos of penguins. You know, when they walk on land, it's not that easy. You know, when they're in the water, they fly. But when they're on land, it's kind of waddle and hard work for them. It's almost like he's taking one step at a time to do it. And one step at a time from a leadership point of view is to take a measured approach. And when we try and do too much, we actually don't get anything done. Because the escalator will take you there, trust the process, stay in the process. And in this particular morning, I got this incredibly poignant picture of, of the cleaner on, on one of the Dubai beaches with the glitz and glamour of, of the Dubai skyline in the background. All those people that are staying in these big buildings and all these big CEOs and directors and rich people, what do they think about the cleanup? And empathy is, is understanding and put yourself in another person's shoes and have them inspired and work for you much harder and much better. We all face a situation where we have huge pressure on us and we have to make decisions fast. So there's a great story on this one. This leopard encroached in an area where there were a pack of wild dogs, 14 African wild dogs. He couldn't consult with, with other leopards or send an email overseas to the boss leopard to say, well, what do you think? He needed to act and he needed to act at that point. And we're faced with this sort of thing all the time. I think we need to trust our instinct. Do we trust the leaders? Their ability to get empathy, their ability to get curiosity, their ability to get engagement, motivate their employees. That's where they start taking the responsibility for this technology when we're going into because it's going to become far more human.